Hello, in this video I am going to show you how to share your voice thread once you have created and added comments to that. I am going to choose the same voice thread that I have used in my two earlier videos. So let's click on this India's map. Now once I am here, it will start playing my comments automatically. So I am just pausing them right now. Now you will see this. Uh, bars on the left hand corner click on that you'll see different options so i'm going to choose the option for sharing right now click on that you will see four different ways to share there's a basic way to share where you simply get a link or the embed code if you're going to get the link you have the option of choosing if you want people with that link just to view it or view and add comments or if you don't want them to do either of those so basically keep it for your own purposes so let's say if i don't want people to add comments then i just click on view if i don't want them either view or comment then unclick both or if i want them to add uh, to view and then add comments I click on those and then copy link now this link is copied to the clipboard you see this message here to test if that link works or not open another window in your browser and simply paste your sharing link and then see if that works okay so now you see this voice thread loading here so it works so now you can share this link via email or post it on a web page to share it with the public or you can also choose embed option here you see this embed code here simply click on copy embed code and upload it to your web page just like you uh, upload any other um, embed code and again you have the option here of choosing viewing or commenting either of those or none let's go to the secure option of sharing now secure option is done via groups or contacts now you can add contacts simply by clicking on this plus icon and then you will be able to enter their email address their name and assign them to a certain group if you want maybe class one class two or your family or your school team and um, once you have the details then you can save them then once you have the contacts you can assign them to different groups so for example uh, click on the groups now if you want to create a new group you can again clicking that plus icon enter the name of the group and enter a description for the group here you can choose a different background here for the header maybe you want to choose this and hopefully it will appear here when you create the group right now we are not creating the group so just cancel it I already have three groups here so let's say if I choose the Thursday Hindi class then again you have the option whether you want them to be able to view if not unclick that if if they cannot view they cannot also comment so you cannot choose that option now if you want them just to be able to view but not comment then choose that if you want them also to be able to edit you can choose that and then if you want them to be notified by email you have that option of clicking here if not simply share it with them so when they log into their account they will be able to see the voice thread that was shared with them so that is another way of sharing your voice thread now the third one is third button is for deciding uh, the level of privacy of your voice thread so these are publishing options if you choose anyone can comment or anyone can view then you have the option of publishing this voice thread on the general browser page where people can see your voice thread or search for it if you don't want that and you want to keep it completely private then you don't publish it you don't have the option of publishing on the browser page it's private and 
you will be able to select it securely with your group members and then another option is exporting it which is not yet available in this new version of voice thread but you will be able to switch back to the older version for some time now and then share export it um, to uh, to your account wherever you want it to be exported all right so this is how you share your voice threads have fun with it and i'll see you in the next video